Looking forward to having Glenn Cotson joining us for the weekend's big racing. And he's going to start on Friday in race one with Set for Life. Now, Glenn describes his filly as an improving sort who enjoyed stepping up to the mile last time out. And with James Lehaba on board on Friday, the advantages are twofold. She's going to come in carrying only 52 kilos, and he feels James is riding exceptionally well at this point in time. He does feel with the good work that Set for Life is showing, she's going to be able to give the boys a run for their money. We move to race two where we will see Red William and he's in the box behind me. He put in a really good effort last time out which was his post maiden run and he took the run well. Glenn says he's been freshened up, he's fit and well and another good run is expected. And then of course the feature of the afternoon, the Racehorse Owners Association stakes a listed event over the mile and here the yard will be represented by Hats Pride. Glenn says he's a nice young horse, improving all the time. The blinkers are off. You must remember he is stepping up to the mile. That does make sense. And Glenn is expected to enjoy the distance. He definitely has respect for a Cape Raider in the way of Brett Crawford's runner, as well as a couple of the locals. But he says he's very chuffed at the moment where, with Hats, where Hats Pride is, and he will be disappointed if he doesn't finish in the first three.